Hey everyone, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're diving into something super interesting that many of you have been asking about. How to get some of that Magisk magic without actually rooting your phone. That's right, we're talking about Magisk Vexiro, or as some like to call it, Magisk Vexiro. Now, before we jump in, let's be super clear. This is not traditional Magisk. That gives you full root access. Magisk Vexiro is a fantastic solution for those who want to use certain Magisk modules but either can't root their device or simply prefer not to for various reasons, like warranty concerns, banking apps that detect root, or even just simplicity. So how does it work? Magisk Vexiro achieves its functionality by leveraging the power of Shizuku. Because it relies on Shizuku, it's important to understand that not all Magisk modules will be supported. Modules that require deep system-level root access, like those that modify core system files or bypass safety net on a fundamental level, won't work here. However, many utility and cosmetic modules that function through, Shizuku's permissions will function just fine. We're talking things like custom fonts, some ad blockers, certain UI tweaks, or even specific app optimizations. All right, let's get straight to the installation steps. It's quite straightforward, but pay attention to the details. First things first, you'll need the Magisk Vexiro APK file. As always, you can find the download link in the video description below. Once downloaded, if this is your first time installing an APK from outside the Google Play Store, your phone's security settings will probably block it by default. Now, navigate to where you downloaded the APK file. Tap on the APK file to initiate the installation process. Now open Magisk Vexiro and set up Shizuku. Follow the on-screen instructions within Magisk Vexiro to start Shizuku. This typically involves connecting your phone to a PC and using ADB commands, or if your device supports it, using the wireless debugging option from developer. Options on your phone for a PC-less setup. And there you have it. That's the basic process for installing. Magisk Vexiro on your non-rooted Android device. Remember, the key here is Shizuku, so make sure you set that up correctly. It might take a couple of minutes the first time, but it's well worth it. If you encounter issues, always double check that Shizuku is running. Sometimes, after a phone reboot, Shizuku might need to be restarted manually or via its persistent notification. If you found this video helpful, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for more cutting edge tech tips and Android customization guides and hit that notification bell so you don't miss our next video. Let me know in the comments below if you've tried Magisk Vexiro, what your favorite non-root modules are, or if you have any questions. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay customized.